Yo, what is going on guys here? My name is Xbuzzer Man and today I got for you a special Minecraft tutorial. What we're going to be teaching you guys how to do today is how to build a Minecraft wooden house. Now this is going to be a Minecraft wooden mansion basically and what we're going to be doing is I'm going to find a picture and it should appear right about now of what I will be trying to build. I'm going to try to eyeball it and I teach you guys how to build this and it should be quite a few parts, not as many as the modern house, but uh, yeah, if we get right into it and start speaking speed building we should be able to be good to go one thing I do have to ask you guys for a favor is if you watch my minecraft how to make a modern house and you followed along to the end I was wondering if you guys could send me that world save so I could continue working on the interior on that base I have had a problem where I accidentally deleted the save and I cannot get it back for the life of me so if you guys could go ahead and send me that I would definitely appreciate I appreciate it so I can go ahead and finish that up I don't like leaving things un, you know undone or still going so yeah that's um that's pretty much it let's go ahead and get on into the build so yeah we're on super flat land um, and creative so I cannot tell you the exact amount of materials needed but uh, we're gonna go ahead and uh, assume that you're probably on creative as well if you're not good luck to you so let's go ahead and get some essentials here what we're gonna be doing is we're going to get some oak wood planks uh, I'm just kind of eyeballing the picture right now. Um, it looks like oak wood planks are pretty much uh, the main thing. Probably oak wood planks and those glass, some glass and probably some fence. That's going to be probably pretty good, some oak fence. So yeah, let's go ahead and uh, start that up right about now. So um, let's see what we can do here. We're going to start off with a few pillars and we're going to make this a certain lengths wide. Let's just go ahead and go up about, I'd say about five. Yeah, this looks about good. One, that's what, one, two, three, four, five. Yep, that's about five. And then we're going to space these out actually quite a bit. I'm just using this as a spacing tool. So that was what, one, two, three, four, five, six, probably a few more, seven, eight, nine, ten. We're probably space them out about 10 a piece. So yeah, so go ahead and space them about about 10 a piece each pillar. And then five up. Oh, that was about seven up. You do not have to make this little wooden thing right here, this little wooden um, filling I made. I'm gonna actually fill that in with about gravel. So yeah, don't do that. So what we're gonna do is this is going to be the main area. So we're gonna make three pillars and they're gonna be 10 wide. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. All right, two, three, four, five. All right, so that's the main area right there. What we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and uh, kind of complete that little main area right there. We'll go about, I'd say about three down, and then make that five up for this pillar right here. Do the exact same thing with this one, three wide, and then five up. So these are just the pillars to start the lower half. Alright, so what we're going to do now is we're going to add on to these by um, finding a different shade of wood. And we're going to use birch wood planks for this one right here. So let's go ahead and get that right there. And then just make a wall right across this whole bad boy. Alright. Uh, I'm just checking the time real quick. Make sure, see what my time constraints will be. I'm going to try to make each episode about 30 minutes long. And uh, hopefully that will be pretty good. Alright, so that's going to be that right there. Um, we could do two rows. I'm not sure. I don't think I want to do two. Uh, personally, I'm not 100% sure yet. Yeah, I think I'm going to keep one. That looks about solid. You know, yeah, we'll keep one right here. We'll just keep one layer. Or we could... No, we'll keep one. Alright, so now we're going to get our fencing. And then just fence this off. Alright, let's do this real quick. If you guys want to see a different kind of build, I was thinking maybe something underwater or something after that. Um, we're going to try to get this one done real fast. This is going to be basically a majority of our Minecraft content pumped out for you guys. And uh, it should be pretty good. So um, we're actually going to fill this top little balcony off right, real quick with our birch oak wood. I think that's what it's called, right? Birch wood planks. Now if you're doing this in survival and you can't find any birch wood, it will just be totally fine for you guys to use um, 
regular oak wood. This is just to add a kind of effect of uh, color transitioning to our architectural skim, scheme. And I will have this world force save once we're done. Um, I know since some people tend to wonder if it will be done, and um, it will. All right, so we're going to start with this little base right here. Now, what we're going to do is we're going to need to find a new wood, and this one's going to be our jungle wood. So let's go ahead and get on into that. It looks like these are somewhere on the lines of like this. So we're just going to create a base like this. Um, we don't want them connecting. We don't want this pillar and this bir birch wood or this, what is it, jungle wood to connect to one another. We're just going to fill that in to the top right here. And it's going to be something like that. You don't have to use that one to the top, but I, I'm just tending to use it for the fact that um, it's just convenient right now. All right. So now we're going to go ahead and get on into some oak wood planks once again. And we're going to fill this bottom row right here, kind of like this. So let's go ahead and do that. So this is going to be a start to our little base area right here. And uh, there's actually, it shows three windows along this area. So we're going to see how many there are. You don't have to delete these like I am. I'm just trying to find the necessary spacing. First, I'm going to time set day this. Um, so just hold on for a minute. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. All right, so there's 17. So let's uh, factor in about 16, something, 18. Yeah, 18 will be pretty good because you can do every six ones, every six times. And uh, we'll do that. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Add some glass in there. Actually, we're going to add some birch wood right there. One, two, three, four, five, six. So we're not going to do every three like these guys are doing. We're just going to go ahead and do something on the lines of it, not 100%. We'll just build up from right here. So do something on the lines of that. And um, just like that, we'll eventually fill that in real quick. That one's actually too much. So we're just trying to get this one. Alright. Um, you can do that. That's just a little effect that's nice. We'll probably eventually end up filling that in. But uh, for right now, we're just going to do that. So just fill that in with glass. And um, yeah. What we're going to do, I think what we can do with this one in the middle is we can make it a little bit bigger. So we'll do something like that maybe somewhere on the lines of that like this boom 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 just because we don't want it to be completely filled like that all right yeah that looks good we're gonna keep it like that we're gonna go around back there and just fill this in like that all right so we're just starting on with the main base area and we're gonna go ahead and fill in this jungle wood once again fill in the, the rest of the space with jungle wood. Doop, doop, doop. Let's go fill this. Oh, little lag spike there. I'm sorry guys for that. Sorry for that little experience. And uh, yeah, that looks pretty good right there. Um, what we're going to eventually do is uh, extend this out. So it's going to be something like that. Extend it out a little bit. So uh, I want to keep it we're going to extend it out just to two blocks right here. Just so I know what we're doing. Um, and then I'm going to fill this in with jungle wood. We're just going to, just so I have a basis of what I want to do. All right. You guys don't have to do this, but um, if you guys would like, you guys can go ahead and do it. It's pretty proactive. All right. So I think this build is actually coming on a little bit more concise and down to the point than my modern house tutorial was man that was that was quite something there that was that was quite the uh, the noobish build alright so what we're gonna do is we're gonna fill this in and what we're trying to do now is we're gonna try to make this a little triangle so we're gonna build up just a little bit and then we're gonna start triangulating it in triangulating it in alright 
uh, we don't want to make it too big but then again we don't want to make it too small so we'll just keep eyeballing it um, that looks about like it's gonna be too big so we're gonna do something about that I think that's pretty good to me too little is actually a little bit better because sometimes too much it just makes everything off proportion and uh, not good so yeah what we're gonna do is just that right there that was how many box one two three one two three four five so go up five blocks on each one one two three four five and um, what we're gonna actually do right here is we're gonna create a little line around this just a little horizontal line and we'll eventually fill this in with windows so let's go ahead let's see how many down this is one two don't you don't have to do this part two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen seventeen so it's just I could have planned that out better I could have just known that was seventeen once again alright so we're gonna do the kind of the same uh, process as we did down below but a little bit more of a grand scale um, We'll do something on the lines. That one looks a little off center. No, we're good. Let's not. We'll do something on the lines of this right here. So do one up. Yeah, do one up like this, and fill this in with oak wood points down, like that. And um, we're gonna do that same exact thing with this side right here fill that in with oak wood planks all right and now what we're gonna do after that is we're gonna go ahead and make this one a little bit larger of a scale three three one two three one two three one two three I think we could do four and that would perfectly align so we're gonna do four like that and that way you get a perfect alignment all right one thing to note is that we're going to do something like this. Just fill this in like this because we're going to add two more glass planes right here. We're actually probably add something like that right there. And then two, three, three wide down glass plane. Okay. Alright, so it's going to look something like that. Um, and we might end up making adjustments. We might not put that in there in particular. Um, but. Uh, overall not looking bad alright so what we're gonna do is we're gonna start staggering this right here so go ahead and just start staggering it each side you have to make this 100% equally proportional on each side so we're gonna do five up just I would recommend doing it in groups of five and then as you can start you can start eyeballing how close it's gonna be I think that's a group of five. One, two, three. No, that's not. Oh crap! There we go. Yeah, something like that. Hopefully, we get to a pretty good one. Two. One. Two. One. Two. All right. So we're gonna try to get something on the lines of that right there. So how many is that up? Let's see. Starting from here, it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So do a staggering row of nine on top of each side. And then what we're going to do is we're going to fill this in certain areas with glass. Actually, we're going to do something kind of out of the norm right here. Is we're going to go ahead and do something like this. And then just vault it out a little bit like that um, yeah we're gonna do that should we change it a different color guys so we keep this the same color or should we add an element of just um, maybe spruce wood or oak wood see the thing about oak wood would be we would have to get them right every time my um, 
if you guys want to use oak wood you can you don't have to but I'm gonna go ahead and use oak wood just for the fact that I think it looks pretty good and I'll add a little dimension to it so I'll go ahead and add that just stagger it out like this and um, if you're using oak wood keep it all in the same area just kinda like this oh crap alright so like that boom boom why did I just do that? Alright. Alright. It's looking pretty good. This is our first error of the day. I kind of wanted to change this because I think it'd look a little bit better if uh, we made the roof, the roof, the roof is on fire. Just regular wood. Like, um, what is he, what do they call Oak wood. Just regular oak wood planks. Not planks, but regular oak wood. And um, we're going to get there real quick. I don't want to leave you guys at any time. So time set day. I don't like working at night. If you guys have any suggestions on how to improve this build, this is actually my first build to where I didn't use an exact Minecraft copy. This is just a, a photo that I saw on the YouTubes. Not on the YouTubes, but Planet Minecraft. And I'll link you to the guy who made this kind of concept. Um, I haven't really... Um, I want to give con okay, okay, okay. I want to give credit to where credit is due. This isn't a jar nine build, unfortunately. He's a great um, builder. If you guys haven't actually seen my Minecraft Modern House tutorial, um, I definitely suggest going to check that out. You're going to be seeing a lot of noobiness going around. Lots of noobs, pony noobs too, to be honest. All right, we're getting there. We're almost done with this. Thankfully, it wasn't a horrendous mistake to wear a horrendous air change in heart. Uh, we want to extend this out to make it give it to look like a roof because you see how those roofs extend and, like, you know, your gutters and all that. All right, I went all the way down here. And you're just going to have to do that every time. So, there you go. There's what it's going to should look like. What we're going to do now is we're going to go ahead and put some, we're going to fill some areas in with, uh, let's do this like this. We're going to fill two areas in with oak wood planks and then we're going to go ahead and fill this in with glass. So yeah, there we go. And then stagger this once again, fill it in with oak wood planks. Fill these two areas in with oak wood planks. And stagger some glass. Alright, almost there. Stagger in some wood. And let's see what we want to do next. I'd say make two really elongated areas. Cut down. Um, if we did that, should we make one really big area or two relatively small ones? I'd say one big area look, would look pretty good. Or maybe you do something on the lines of... Now we'll go ahead and make... We'll see how one looks right now. So we'll just go ahead and do this right here. Just fill in these two little areas. What we could do something like this. This is just kind of a concept right here. Something like this. Alright. See if it looks any good. Yeah, it looks good. It looks good. So we're gonna do that right there. That looks like a doozy. Alright, so area's looking pretty solid. We're gonna go ahead and I think what we can do is we can start adding the next dimension to this. So like I said, this little area right here it has a purpose so what we're gonna do I think we're just gonna end it off right here and then what we're gonna do is we're gonna add the two sides in the next episode and uh, be good from there so yeah thanks for watching guys I hope you enjoyed this first episode I had one error with making those oak wood planks but overall I think we did pretty good we had a solid day um, I'm not sure if I made the 30 minute mark I probably was a little bit short and uh, yeah so 
Sorry for that. Thanks for watching, guys. I'll have part two coming out in about two or three days. So, yeah, that's pretty much it. Thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you next time and uh, later.